And good afternoon, everyone. We welcome you to Fort Wayne, Indiana. It's the national semifinals, better known as the Final Four. And today, Christopher Newport will be taking on Swarthmore College. Trey Barber will jump center with Capriz, the opening tip controlled by Swarthmore, and the Garnet will go left to right across the floor here. On. Driving the right side, Visconti. He gives it away to a new man. Eddie Paquette is checked in. Corzine jump hook, left hand, no good. Rebound brought down by Ian Anderson. Spectacular defense by Anderson, and then the box out after the shot to get the rebound. Anderson dribbles to his right, to the wing, stops, gives it out front to Rodney Graves. Graves will shoot the three, and he hit it. Graves is good from three. He's been very good all tournament. Out from Caprice, and the captains have the rebound. Captains are two of their last 14 shooting. Here's Brody with a great fake. He drives to the basket and he puts it in. Matt Brody's first score of the game, and the captains trail 16 to 12. Ten minutes or so will be very important in the outcome of this game, and that's there's Matt Brody hitting a short jumper. And was Ian Anderson gets the pass, drives inside, Woo! spins, puts it up, and hangs on the rim and goes down for Ian Anderson. Four or five bounces there Lata. for Ian Anderson. Lata now out to John Hines. Hines goes into the paint off the right side. He puts it up, banks it off the glass, and hung on the rim and went down for John Hines, his first field goal of the game. Well, we're ready to start the second half. Swarthmore and CNU in a four-point game. 30-26, to 26, Swarthmore on top in Fort Wayne. John Hines... Into the lane, spins, puts it up and in. John Hines going to work to start the second half. He's got six points. And the captain's pull yeah, to within the locker two. room a little bit. Hines dishes for Barber. Barber down low. Jump hook, right hand is good from Trey Barber, who's got 13 points now, and we're all tied up at 30 30. Ty Henderson. Henderson dribbles. Now he's going to take the shot, and he hits it. Ty <laughs> Henderson for three. We talked about it at halftime. D'Angelo drives down to the baseline, sends it out to Corzine. Now D'Angelo gets it back, penetrates through the lane, puts it up, hangs on the rim, no good. Colin Hines with a rebound. Here come the captains on the run. Ty Henderson right side, pulls up, three-pointer right wing. It's good. We have not seen much on the fast break for the captains. Feeds Trey Barber left of the lane. Barber backing in on Corzine, leans in. little scoop shot is good for Trey Barber. little fake. There's John Hines spinning, shooting, and he's got it. And that's what John Hines does. A thousand points with that fadeaway. Now down low from the big man, Barber. Barber into the paint, turns around, oh. great move, and Trey Barber lays it in. He's got 19 points. Here at the Allen County War Memorial Coliseum, Rodney Graves is going to shoot a three right wing, and he hits it. That's with what four I'm seconds about. to go. As do you foul in this situation to make him go to the foul line for only two shots? There's the pass, D'Angelo dribbling. He gets a good look at the basket off the back of the rim. It's no good, and the captains hang on, and they're going to the national championship game for the first time ever with a 69 to 66 win over Swarthmore. What a great battle, and the captains are able to hang on. Win it 69 to 66. What a win as John Krikorian celebrates. And the captains are 29-3, and, and they've won 14 in a row. Hard to believe. What a season.